What's up YouTubers? Howard Ferris, Editor-in-Chief from Motherboards.org. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Well, today we're going to do the unboxing of the new Sapphire HD5970 Toxic Series featuring 4 gigabytes of memory and supposedly a couple really nice games in the box. So follow around, we'll follow along anyway, as we show you what's inside this box. Okay, so let's open up this new Sapphire Radeon HD5970 and check out what's in the box. Just to let you people know, I'm not really sure of exactly what's going to be in the box. This is actually a pass-around sample. So for you, of you who like to inquire, do we get to keep this sample? Unfortunately, no, we don't get to keep this sample. This sample we have to pass along to some other reviewer. So, let's right, open the box up let's see what we've got going on here. At the very top, see, we've got the graphics card user's manual. Then we have the Sapphire driver CD. Oh, and actually, the pass around thing still has it. We actually have both the coupons for both Modern Warfare 2 and Dirt 2. So, this is the software contents of what comes in the box. We'll move that out of the way and move further. See what we've got. By the way, the card is packed very well. Can't you see us? I'll try to adjust it for the camera. I can see a little bit better. But uh, this card comes very well boxed has great foam insulating on both sides so that when shipping it doesn't get damaged. So let's see here, we've got a box it up here. This must be the accessory cables. So let's take a look at that. And we'll open that up and see what we've got here. So we'll just kind of like dump this stuff out on the table. So we can see what all is in here. So okay. We get it. Here is a nice powered cable. Now, a lot of companies may not include this cable, but this is actually a powered display port cable. It uses your USB power to make the connection between your monitor and the video card. It also comes with a display port to regular display port. We also have a what is this one here? This one is a, looks like an HDMI to standard DVI. And then we've got a normal DVI to old school VGA. And then last but not least, the Crossfire Bridge. So, we'll just go this again. We get the HDMI to DVI, DVI to analog. We'll open this up right here. This is actually DisplayPort to DVI, and then Mini DisplayPort to Splendid DisplayPort, and last but not least, the Crossfire Bridge. Okay. Now we'll take a look at the card itself. It comes in a nice, very, very thick anti-static bag, and wow, is this thing heavy! And right off the bat, all I can say is, holy crap, Batman. Let's take a look at these fans. Wow. This new toxic card comes with three giant fans. Right on top of the PCB, blowing cool air onto it to keep it cool. And underneath this, even though you can't see it, are a bunch of heat pipes. So the heat pipes help dissipate the heat away from the card, and the fans further put cool air on it to dissipate the heat even farther away from the card. This card requires two 8-pin power connectors. And for some reason, those are not in the box here, uh, which means that some reviewer somewhere, reviewers out there, if you're watching this, send the dang things back to Sapphire because they're missing. So we don't have those, but it does take two 8-pin power connectors. Here is your Crossfire Bridge right here, Crossfire Finger, however you want to term it. Here is the rear I.O. You've got two standard DVIs and a main display port output. Here's your PCI, we you stick it in your motherboard. And that's really about it. So that's everything that comes in the box of this new Sapphire Toxic HD5970. Thanks for watching.